Hey, Mark Nelson. Today I want to share with you the number one tip I've learned by going on my Facebook Lives. And it's just on stinking blue. But hey, hang on with me till the very end where I get to share with you the one thing that's helped me probably the most in my Facebook Lives. And guess what? It's this. It's a free PDF, ebook, whatever you want to call it, that gives you tips on what you can do to help you out on your lives. Isn't that cool? Man, can you hear this rain? It is just a downpour here. And in Tennessee, over the last weekend, we had three days of, or two days, we got six inches of rain overnight, something like that. And I'm thinking, believe I am getting. I don't like it anymore. But hey, if you're coming on this live, if you're on the replay, type hashtag replay. Tell me which city you're living in. See, I'm from Andersonville, Tennessee. The small town outside of Knoxville is just um, stinking believable. Nice place. Have any of you gone live? I want to tell you what happened when I went live. See, I want, when I first started out live, it, it actually did a little different, right? And I was bound and determined because I was working with somebody and they told me that I should be going live, right? Because people want to, you need to get out and be noticed. People need to see who you are. So I had to go live. Well, I thought I was okay. I'm a high school teacher. I've been teaching for a long time. I'm in front of people all the time. I can do this. So I remember I got in front of my phone always use my smartphone. I don't use anything else to do lives. I always just use my smartphone. And I got to start my live. And at that time, you hit a button and there was a countdown. Three, two, and I about pooped my pants. Oh my gosh. It felt like I was going on TV. I, it was unbelievable how I felt. I started, it felt like I had the cold sweats. I actually hit and stopped it. Right? And you can still do that in a little bit. You can delete a, a, a Facebook Live if you do it right away. But, man, that countdown, it just freaked me out. I didn't like that stuff at all. Hey, Justin, glad you're on. So, anyway, that was the scariest thing I had. But, and I didn't like doing lives. And to tell you the truth, I still don't like doing lives. I mean, I, I'm okay with them. But I still don't like doing lives. I, I mean, there's something about getting ready and going to the, but I've learned to start talking to people. I know if you've ever been in speech class, I always tell you if you're doing a speech, you got to imagine the, you know, people in the crowd with no clothes on, so you, what, whatever. I remember hearing that stuff, but oh my gosh. Um, it's just, I just start talking to people because I know I help. I help, I give value. My biggest challenge is when I'm with the phone. See, I see some people on there and I need reading glasses. I don't wear reading glasses. Only except when I'm teaching school, so I know I miss some of you, so if I'm not seeing you, peace out, it's dark in my car. So, do you know this? If you, I'm going to ask you this before. If you've done a live, what was your number one struggle? And I want you to type it down below. What was the biggest challenge for you in going live? Because I, I know that's out there. I mean, my challenge was uh, I was a little nervous. I, I didn't know what to talk about. I didn't think I had any value to give. Right? Because sometimes you get on and you listen to some of these people that go live. My lives aren't very long. And I really believe that's a strength. Um, five to ten minutes and that's it. Because I see some of these going on uh, and I'm not bashing. They can talk for a half hour, 45 minutes. That's a webinar. I can't, I don't do that. I, one, I'm not planned out that long. So anyway, what's your biggest struggle going live? And have you gone live yet? If you haven't, would you like the chance to get into our next challenge? It's five days. Five days, and that five days, guess what? There's a prizes at the end, and everyone who does the five days gets a prize. Hang on to the end, and I'll let you know how that can happen. Do you know? And I started this out with that. You have seven seconds to catch people's attention. Seven, five, two, seven seconds to grab their attention. So you want to, when you start your live, you want to right away tell them what you're going to do. 
And I know you've been on lives where people that get in and they start talking. I almost said something I shouldn't have. They start talking about something else and you lose them. They, they lose me. They got to they gotta hook me. They got to get me interested in it. But here's the one tip I really had to learn. I'm going to give you more than one, so you guys hang with me. The one tip I really had to learn was the hook. And I kept hearing it when you hear it in copywriting, there's always a hook or an open loop. You want to throw something at people that keep them around. So if you remember when I started, I said, hey, hang around to the very end and I'll give you your free download. That's the hook. So if people want the download, they gotta stay on the very end to hear how they're going to get it. That was one of the biggest tips I learned in doing my lives. The second biggest one was always to have a call to action. See, I gave the hook, so now at the very end of it, I have to have a call to action. So today's call to action. If you would like this Facebook Live cheat sheet that lets you get in on Facebook Lives and gives you hints on how to become the best Facebook Liver ever. Type download. D O W N L O A D. Capital letters you want. <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. I actually saw somebody who's on here and I thought I was playing with them. If you type download, I will give you the link for this. And by giving you the link for this free book, you know what's going to happen? Is you're going to get noticed when we start the next Facebook Live. See, this is day four. And day five is coming up, and it's been the coolest thing at all. So anyway, if you're on live, tell me that you're live. Tell me what town you're coming from. Type it. If you're coming on the replay, hit Hashtag replay. Tell me the town you're coming from. And then, just tell me if you've been live or not before. If I can help you. See, I can help you by giving you that booklet. So if you want the PDF on the Facebook Live cheat sheet, type download. Hey, leave me some comments. Give me some love. Give me some hearts. You all take care. We will talk soon. I'm going to brave this rainstorm. Man, I'm sick of rain. You all take care. Bye.